It's the nuclear reaction that powers the sun and the stars, and scientists from around the world are hoping that hydrogen fusion could provide endless energy here on Earth. Assembly of the massive reactor that would do the job is now underway in the south of France. The hardest part lies ahead. Construction, constructing the machine piece by piece will be like assembling a giant three-dimensional puzzle on an intricate timeline. The International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor, or ITER, works by heating hydrogen atoms to 10 times the temperature of the sun's core, forcing them to fuse together and releasing energy that will be trapped in this vessel called a tokamak. Unlike nuclear fission, the process used in nuclear power plants, nuclear fusion releases no radioactive waste. Its fuel is found in seawater and lithium, both in abundant supply. The project to build the reactor was launched in 2006 by 35 countries. The United States, Russia, China, Japan, Europe, the Philippines, Europe, l'Inde et la Corée mettant à disposition leurs plus grands scientifiques, leurs meilleurs savoir-faire pour le bien commun. C'est la preuve que ce qui rassemble les hommes et les États est plus fort que ce qui les divise. The project has had some hiccups. ITER is already running five years late and has seen its initial budget triple to 20 billion euros. Plus, there's no guarantee the technology will work. ITER's next landmark, a trial run, is currently scheduled for December 2025.